Hi friends, today let's learn a few quick fixes in Excel through few examples. If you want to separate name and number from a mix of name and number, you, you just type the name and number separately in the first row, then drag it down using Ctrl E option to get the name and number. Now we will see uh, how to sum each section. Okay, okay. We, what we do normally is uh, we put a sum formula for each of the sections, right? Equal to sum and select the range and then we will get the sum for each section. So this is how we normally do in our Excel files. But there is a shortcut to this which you can utilize just select the blanks okay and put the same formula at one go no need to separately type each section you you can do it at one go so what you have to do select the blank cells and write the formula or use a shortcut called alt and equal to to get the sum of those now let's see the third trick this trick is about uh, how to prepare a pivot table in five simple steps first select the data you want to do the pivot second press alt d and p excel shortcuts to bring in the pivot table in a separate tab in the excel file the third step is select the columns you want to see in the pivot the fourth step is about formatting the data how you will do is go to the design tab select tabular format again go to design and select the so all labels under report layout and the third section is uh, go to design tab and of the grand total and subtotal now format the headers to give a better view and your pivot table is ready it's cool and five simple steps the next trick is about how to format the data range right a table is there this is how it looks before formatting the raw data and after formatting how it will look is in the next tab right so beautiful right so what you need to do is select the whole tab Okay. and change the font style change the font size then a uh, column and row height also you need to ensure it's uh, all same right then headers change it to a specific color right maybe uh, the light blue will look very good followed by the font color let let be white okay and navy blue also will look really good to the view okay this is how it looks before formatting and see how how i am doing that okay borders give some border color right it will it it will be visible well so see this is awesome the next trick is around uh, 
using the sum formula and and using the range formula okay to get the addition of uh, number of cells right uh, if you want to add cell a1 to a20 right you have to put the formula sum a1 to a20 okay but in case of range no need of those things you just say equal to sum and say r a n g e range okay you have given a name range for a column and that will pick up the range accordingly so whenever that there is a change in data data so if you are, if you are including row number 21 in the table right it will also include in the for sum for but in case of sum okay you have to manually change the range that is not required in uh, range formula thank you so much for watching my videos uh, please like subscribe and share my video for more such videos in the future thank you so much